Hey guys, on today's video, I'm going to teach you how to delete any picture or any video from your Photos apps. Right now, I'm right here in my Mac, and this is my Photos app. Okay, so that's what I have open right now. And I click on the very first option where it says Photos. So this is the latest OS, by the way. So we're good to go. And right here, I want this picture. So this very last one that you guys see down here, I can just click on it. If you guys right click on it, you guys do have several options right here. So you do have the very last one where it says delete one photo, or I can select many of them. So I can just drag and select all these, for example, or I can select this one, hold shift on my keyboard, then click on any other one of these, and it's gonna select all these. So there's various ways to do this. If you guys want to select them all, you guys can always do command A on your keyboard and that's gonna select all of them, okay? So that's the shortcut, Command A, all right? So that's how you guys can select. Once you guys do that, you can always right click and do Delete, or you guys can press Command Delete on your keyboard again, and that's gonna get rid of that picture. So if I press Command Delete, that's what I usually do. I usually use my keyboard a lot because it's just faster, something you guys have to get used to. So once that's deleted, you're good to go. So that's a picture, for example. Now, if I have videos, so right here, videos, Let's just click on there and let's see what videos we can delete. So we got these videos right here and let's say I want to get rid of this last one. So right here, I can right click again and just put delete one video or command delete and it's gonna delete it. So what happens with these deleted videos and pictures? They still take up space on your Mac and that's because they have landed right here under recently deleted. So if you guys don't want those pictures to take up space on your Mac anymore, all right, and to permanently delete them, you guys do have to empty this out. So once again, we can click on here, we can zoom out a little bit just to show you. And right here on the right hand side, you guys will see this button, delete all. So we can select that and delete all of them. And then you guys won't be able to recover them. Or what we can do is just select one of them and put delete one item, okay? Or you guys can recover them. So you do have those two options, just in case you guys didn't really want to delete that, you guys can always recover it or just permanently delete it. So in this case, what I'm gonna do is just select this, for example, and I'm gonna delete one. And that's gonna empty it out again. So right here, we're gonna get this message and it's gonna let us know if we want to do this. So we're gonna click okay, and it's gone forever. Okay, so we can click on this one as well, delete, and there we go. Or, like I told you guys, you guys can delete them all. So I'm not gonna delete them all just yet, but that's an option that you guys can do. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.